today we'll be showing you guys how to replace the rear motor on your Apollo Pro 2023. For this repair, the tools required is a 21 millimeter wrench, a four millimeter Allen key, a 2.5 millimeter Allen key, and a heat gun, and you should be good to go. So the first thing we're gonna do is remove the rubber caps on the motor nuts. We can use an Allen key to do this. Put them to the side for now. And next, we'll go ahead and loosen our drum brake. Remove the adjustment screw. We'll take the line out of the arm. We'll remove the placeholder pin and put it to the side as well. Same with the spring. Then we will go ahead and pull the brake line from it, the placeholder. You can go ahead and pull it out like that. And next we'll go ahead and disconnect the motor from its quick connector. Unscrew the quick connect and then we'll go ahead and loosen the motor nuts. Once we pull the motor from the swing arm, the connector will disconnect. You may notice that you're having a hard time removing the nuts from the motor. And this is because they add Loctite to the nuts. We recommend taking a heat gun or a hairdryer and heating up the area to loosen up the Loctite. So now with the area heating up, we'll go ahead and attempt to loosen. So now we could go ahead and loosen. We'll do the same thing for the other side. And now that we've got both of our screws, uh, both of our nuts loose, we can go ahead and remove the screw that holds the drum in place. Put the screw to the side, and now we can continue removing the nuts all the way. So now we'll go ahead and remove the fender as the motor will not be able to come off because the fender goes too far back. So first we'll remove the rubber caps from the brackets. Now we'll go ahead and remove the two screws on each bracket that hold it in place. And now we will remove the four screws that hold it in the back. Now we can go ahead and remove the fender. We'll put it to the side for now. And next we should be able to get the motor off of its swing arms. They should just slide right out, but if they are not, you could grab an Allen key and use it to help push the axle. Make sure to have a hand underneath as it might just fall when you remove it. So now it's important to remember when removing the motor to remember where the washers go. For the Pro, in this case, it is very easy because it is only one on each side. So now we can go ahead and start putting our motor back. For the purpose of this video, we will be reusing the same motor. All right, so first things first is making sure that our drum brake is lined up with the hole that holds the drum brake in place. In 
order to make sure that our drum brake does not shift while tightening our motor, we're gonna go ahead and put the screw that holds it in place back where it belongs. Next, we'll put back our motor nuts. Now we'll go ahead and start the process of putting the fender back. And last but not least for the fenders, make sure to just put back the rubber caps that go on the bracket. So now continuing with the motor, we'll go ahead and put the brake line back in its placeholder. Now we'll go ahead and put the spring back on the brake line. We'll put the placeholder piece back in the arm. And now we'll put the adjustment screw. And last but not least, we'll go ahead and put the rubber caps over the motor nuts. And that is how you replace the rear motor on your Apollo Pro 2023.